Hey guys, and welcome to part two of the closet cleanout video. I noticed that in the last part, I actually missed a shirt. It's hard to know if I'm missing things because a lot of things are actually just at my boyfriend's. I haven't worn this shirt in a while because um, I feel like it just always goes down. But I absolutely love this shirt and my sister pointed out the brand. I didn't know this brand. It's um, Meshki and I didn't know that was a good brand when I got this shirt from the thrift store. But my sister pointed out that it's a really good brand and um, I think I'm going to keep it even though like the shirt like kind of like gravitates down. Um, I do really like it so. <laughs> shirts okay I don't think there's gonna be many shirts that we're getting rid of my goal for this part of the video I'm gonna say like the second part five items so anyways <laughs> let's get started with the actual shirts this one is inside out oh this is just one of my little comfy shirts something that I'll like wear over at the gym you know it's it's really loose I wear it like it's an extra large I wear it over top of like sports bra and like my um, shorts at the gym that one is a definite keep um this one is probably also a keep it's not really like my favorite but it's something that I kind of wear like in front of like my boyfriend's family and stuff like kind of more of like a tame option of clothes you know <laughs> okay this one's texture absolutely drives me nuts, but I really like that it's like, I don't know. I really like the design on it, so I'm keeping this one. Next, um, I think this is my boyfriend's, but it's just a plain white shirt. You can always use a plain white shirt, so that's gonna stay. Yeah, there's not going to be much that I get rid of here, I don't think. My MTV shirt, again, something that I wear, like, at the gym and stuff and, like, to bed. And then we have this one. Uh, my boyfriend's Nana really likes Snoopy, so I usually wear this one whenever we're out with her. And we have this my boyfriend hates this one but i like it as like an again like a beach cover-up so i'm keeping it nonetheless even though my boyfriend hates it um this is a keep what is this one Ooh. this one is just a little tommy hill figure and i'm gonna be honest i don't know if i like this one i can't tell if it's like blue or if it's black like i feel like it's like a, a really dark navy blue and I just I don't know if I like this one on me so I think this one's gonna go this is the first one in this part and what was our goal again I think I said five okay next item another plain white tee that is also definitely my boyfriend's. I don't really wear white, but we'll keep it. Okay, this shirt is not like a shirt that I like. It's a shirt that I wear for like interviews or like, let's say there was a funeral or something. This is like that kind of shirt. So that one's a keep because well, it kind of has to be. It's like the only shirt that I have for that kind of occasion. This one I got from my boyfriend. This is a keep, even though I feel like his face looks funny. Like, I feel like they did the color weird. They like saturated it and made it orange. But this one's a keep. This one I call my gingerbread man shirt. I'm sure this was in one of my haul videos. And it's Tommy Hilfiger. I like it, it's cute. It's good for Christmas at like my boyfriend's like rich family members houses. I think it's really fitting for that. Next, we just have this Nirvana t-shirt. I used to be really into Nirvana. Um, so don't even do that thing where it's like name whatever songs. Um, I used to listen to them quite a bit. I don't listen to them anymore, 
but I'm gonna keep the shirt nonetheless because I don't know. <laughs> it is like a $20 shirt and I don't want to get rid of it. This one I got for Christmas from my boyfriend's grandma. I hate it. I hate to say that I hate it, but I hate it. And I feel so bad because I like, I, all the clothes she gets me for like Christmas, I always end up getting rid of because like they're not my style. And like, I feel really bad about it, but it just, it's the truth. Like, I don't really like this. So I'm gonna have to get rid of it. The next item is a turtleneck. It's very scratchy, but someone wanted me to use it for like a video once on my other channel. Um, so I'm gonna have to keep this. Um, oh, this is a, a painting shirt. We'll, um, I guess, keep that in my painting little section, I guess. That over here. Another really cute, like, shirt sweater thingy. Um, this one is Zara. I like this one. This one is a keep. And now we are going to move on to the sweaters. I have so many sweaters and they take up so much space that I have to kind of do these in sections because they don't all fit on the chair, but we're going to start with this one. Okay. I have been trying to convince myself that I like this one and then I'll wear it, but I don't. Like, I like that the pockets are zip up, but I never wear this and I'm probably not ever going to wear this if we're being honest with ourselves. So this is going to go in the cell pile. This one I got recently. We're gonna keep this one. I like the little, the little pattern there. It's a cropped one. I don't really wear cropped sweaters anymore, but still a keep nonetheless. This one I got a while ago and the string came out. It's Tommy Hilfiger and it's color. I don't really have much color, so this is obviously a keep. Here's another one I got recently. This one is also colored um actually i think i got this one like a year ago i got the pants to this set recently um i don't really like the fit of it but i'm gonna keep it um little pockets um not sure when i'll wear it maybe sometime with some like tights or something like leggings this next one is an automatic keep i got this on a trip um it was like a trip in my province, but like a trip nonetheless. And I got it from a tattoo shop. Um, this is like my favorite sweater. Paid like 60, $60 for it, I think. 60 or 80. I don't know, I love it. It's like my favorite. Another one of my favorite sweaters, this is a zip up and it just says, it's like really oversized. It says Atlanta, Atlanta again on the back. Um, and me and my boyfriend kind of share this sweater. It's mine, but like we share it. <laughs> this one's a definite keep. This one's like my favorite sweater of all time. This one's a newer one that I got. I am trying to incorporate more color into my life. So this one is a keep because it's also really recent. Let me get the rest of the sweater stack. I have the rest of the sweaters here, but I'm also gonna try on this jacket over here closer to the end of the video. But yeah, the rest of the sweaters are over here and then we're gonna be on to part three, which is gonna be the pants, shorts, all that stuff. The first sweater is this one. Um, I think my boyfriend got it one year for like Christmas or something. Um, and he just didn't really like it that much. And so I took it, but I'm starting to not really like it. So I think this is a get rid of. I don't wear it. I've been convincing myself that I will, but I don't and I haven't, so. We have, oh, there's a sock. We have this little camo zip up that I got from my brother. We're gonna keep this one. I just got this from him recently and I need more zip up sweaters. So this one is a keep. 
We have this Hollister cropped one. I like this one. I haven't really worn it, but I will. I will wear it when like the weather starts being like cool, but like not too cool, you know, like, like sweater weather, you know, that's when I'll start wearing this. Then we have this van sweater. I don't really like the texture, but I think I will wear this like not often, but I will wear it. So that's a keep. Okay, this is one that I don't think I'll wear. It's Mercules. This was my boyfriend's sweater. I don't know if he wants it back or not, but this one's a no for me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask him after this video though if he wants it back because yeah. Then we have this one. This one, um, I think I'll wear it. This one was also my boyfriend's obviously. Then we have these ones. Um, okay, one of them has a damaged thing and that's the one that I'm gonna get rid of. This one is fine. I'll wear this, I guess, not often, but you know. Oh my God, my all time favorite sweater. I know I said that with two other sweaters already, but my Harley Davidson, this one is a keep, keep, keep. I love it, it's my favorite sweater ever. Best sweater, best purchase, best thrift find. And then we have, well, where's the other one? I think it might be at my boyfriend's. Um, and then we have this one that I got recently. I need my mom to sew it. So if she can't sew this back together, then I'm not gonna keep it. But hopefully she can. And that is all for the sweaters. I'm thinking about like, if I want to do the other part in this one, and I think I will. Just let me try on this jacket and then we'll do that. It has like shoulder pads, which I'm not sure I'm really feeling. I'm just making sure that this jacket fits. Um, it's a Danier jacket, if that's how you pronounce it, I'm not sure. Um, see, like, I feel like it's a little tight, but I like it nonetheless and I feel like it could be really cute like obviously I can't zip it up but I wouldn't want to or well button it up but I wouldn't want to anyways I kind of just want to wear it like this so I think I might keep it I'm just gonna give myself opportunities to wear it first and then if I don't then I'll get rid of it but I paid $30 for it at a thrift store, so like I don't really want to get rid of it because like that's a lot of money. <laughs> but yeah, so that's that. We're going to move on to the skirts and shorts. Okay, we're starting off with one that makes me really upset. The zipper is stuck, so I can't wear it. Um... Cause, like I'd need to like unzip it to get it on but this is Abercrombie and Fitch and I'm gonna see maybe if my boyfriend's little sister wants it but it's really cute and I wish that I could wear it but I can't so that one is a get rid of next one are these shorts that I wear to the gym or like when I'm biking because like it has the extra shortness on those and I'm keeping those these shorts are like a little small on me but like again if I lose weight also they do fit me enough just not like perfectly <laughs> so I'm keeping these if I lose weight I'm gonna need it I have this skirt oh my god everything keeps falling As I was saying, I have this skirt and like it doesn't fit me right now, but I keep fluctuating in weight and every time I go down it fits and then I go up and it doesn't. So I'm keeping this because <laughs> again, if I lose weight, it's gonna fit again. I have these really kind of like ugly shorts. Like these would look good on some people, just not me because I have that like small waist, thick, like 
wide hips um, and I feel like these just don't look good on that body type but I am going to keep these because I will wear them on occasion when I'm just like not trying to be cute. These are my favorite shorts. These are a keep for sure. I wear them all the time in the summer. Our next ones are these Calvin Klein. I don't even know if I've tried them on yet, but I'm like almost 100% sure that they fit. And those are a keep. I haven't worn them yet because it's not summer, but then we have these ones. These fit, again, just something to wear to the gym or biking or whatever. These ones are American Eagle and I love these. They don't fit the best, they're a little tight, but when I lose weight slash if I lose weight, these are gonna fit perfectly. Also, like, I still wear them, they're just not the best fit ever, but I love them. They're supposed to be like rolled up, so don't even look at them, hang on. <laughs> Cause they look so much better when they're rolled. Like, look, oh my God, it does not wanna stay rolled. When it's on the body, it stays rolled. <laughs> Just roll it extra so that it stays. See the difference? So much better roll. But yeah, so that's that. And then another skirt, again, same situation as the last skirt. Um, yeah, so if, yeah, <laughs> you get the point. I have these shorts that I just wear to bed usually they're from Ardeans nothing special just what I wear to bed sometimes and then we have these shorts that I got recently I like that they had pockets um are these camo you can see it more on camera oh my god wait they're camo are they actually or am I like tripping in real life they don't look camo but on camera they look camo and it's stressing me out huh that's interesting, did not know that. Um, also it has a zipper pocket, so that's good for the gym, for my key, so. And then we have this like pencil skirt and this is so not something I would usually wear, but I tried it on. I don't hate it, like maybe for like a photo shoot or something, you know? Like that's like the only situation that I'll wear this probably, but it's still cute. Look at how big our pile of keeps is. Anyways, next is the pants. This one's a rough one. I have a lot more pants than I thought. <laughs> so like, I can't really stack them up, which means it's gonna be kind of rough to show them as well. Maybe, can I manage? Okay, that's good for now. I just have these sweatpants very loose, very comfy on the days that I don't want to try. We have these American Eagle like cargo little things. Favorite pants. These are a keep. Um, these are just some tights with like the little air bubbles and it has like the pocket, which I really like. Um, I like having the little pocket keep. Okay, now these ones also have a little pocket, but the pocket is broken. And these are so comfy, but I'm gonna have to throw these out because the pocket is broken and yeah, they're just, they're gonna break soon. Like everything's gonna break. We also have these ones. These ones have the little pockets as well. This one's a keep. Then we have these. I don't remember having these and they look like they'll fit. So I guess that's a keep. We have more leggings. These are a keep. And more leggings, which probably don't fit me right now. But again, my weight fluctuates a lot. And when I'm at my lower weight, these will fit. They're just Calvin Klein's. We have these really comfy Reebok ones just a cute little design. I honestly don't think we're gonna get rid of anything else with the pants. Um, I have a lot of jeans that like don't fit me, but like again, if I lose weight, cause American Eagle jeans are expensive, so I don't wanna get rid of them and then like I lose weight. So we're gonna keep those. 
we have these, the ones that match the sweater, but um, I wouldn't wear them together, but it's still cute to have them match. Um, another pair of Calvin Klein. Those are a keep. And just more jeans that do not fit, but hopefully will soon. These are really cheap from Blue Notes, so I think they will break really soon. I got them for Christmas. Um, but I'm going to keep them until they do break, which will probably be soon. So, not very long, but more jeans, just basic black jeans. More basic black jeans. These are black mom jeans with holes that are from American Eagle. They do not fit, but one day. <laughs> okay, this pair is the one that's going to go. These, I feel like didn't fit nice so we're getting rid of those and then we have more tights just oh my god these are really short is that how long my legs are geez anyways keep <laughs> and the last item is also a keep so in total we got rid of how many items i think there's like three in the garbage maybe these are all the items we got rid of so there's one Ooh, that does not want to come out two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and then twenty, twenty one. 22 22 items plus the two that i need to see if my mom can sell and if she doesn't then yeah um i think that's successful we only aimed for 10 and we got 22 so that's double what i wanted <laughs> proud of myself um there's still a lot of clothes as you can see but i got a nice, nice little chunk down not much but something nonetheless um it's progress maybe next time we'll be able to get rid of more um but yeah that was my closet clean out um <laughs> thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed and hopefully i will see you in another video soon bye